Hey guys, Gina here. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Heisei Jump 2018-2019 to calendar. Um, it finally came today. I actually did order this um, after the pre-order. I didn't pre-order it, so it came in pretty good time. I ordered it off Yes Asia because when I was going to order it, it was sold out on Jet City Japan. But then I went back on like a week later and it wasn't sold out, so I'm so confused. I could have used my points and I could have got points, but oh well, it's here now and um, let's get straight into it. Um, they did package this quite well this time, which I'm very happy about because Seed Japan have had uh, past or not packaging items very nicely. Okay, so the front looks like this. It has a nice black design. Heisei Jump Calendar 2018-2019. The back, very simple. And the sides are also very simple. The box is a little bit damaged, which I am a little bit sad about, to be honest, because I like keeping the boxes in pristine condition. But this one looks like you actually have to cut the whole box, which is kind of annoying, because normally they have a little tab. So let's get... Oh, I don't want to ruin the box, okay. Oh no, I don't want to scratch it. Oh, oh. I'm sorry, I'm very bad with this. Oh, no, no, no. Mm, I scratched the box. Oh, well. And I could probably do this with like a craft knife, but I couldn't find mine. I have to use scissors. Okay. Let's open. Come on, share my reaction with me. Da -da. Oh my gosh, the colors. Okay, so opening, you see this. The first thing that come out. Oh, it's a little disc calendar. This looks very cute. Let's open this first. Um, a little bit of bubble wrap, which is nice. Whoa. Okay. So oh, by the looks of it, it's like, oh, this is so cute. This can replace my other disc calendar that I've got. Oh my gosh. So here. First page is stickers. These are cute. I'll probably never use them because I'll keep them nicely. Um, in comparison, these cards are thinner than the previous year's cards and they are a lot smaller. So, Hazy Jump Calendar. So, they're not calendar pieces per se, they're just real nice photos. Okay. Oh my god, Kato. Oh no, they are calendars! Hikaru. These are monthly calendars though, instead of weekly like the other one. Which is kind of good because last year I found it kind of annoying having to like change them weekly. I'd always forget and miss out on photos. January, oh my god, Kato. He was in the middle of eating the apple. He did not want that for. Oh my god, Yamada. Oh, Kato. Arioka, beautiful child. Ah, oh my god, Yamada looks so done. You know. Oh, Yabu. Beautiful. Chinan. Oh my god, that's a real nice photo of Chinan. Oh, this Sanin. Kono Sanin. So cute. Oh, Yuti. And the last photo. Kato stretching. It's black and white. And oh, that's so cute. That looks so cuddly. The next thing in the box is huge. Oh my gosh. It's huge. Wow. Okay, so the front looks like this. Kato looks very handsome and very like, rocker style. The back is very simple, has their names on it. Two weeks diary? That does not make sense. It's like a diary that goes by two weeks. Sides. Oh, there's a hint. Okay, how does, does it slide out? Oh, remember's name's here. They're very nice. So I think it just slides out. Does. There's a piece of cardboard in there to help it not move. Oh my god, this looks beautiful. What the hell? Okay, so it's a mint green diary with gold letters and the gold spine. Johnny's official Hazel Junk calendar. The same logo as it has on the front. And the back is just plain. Oh my god. Oh my god. So 
so yes, the first page is a very, like, it's transparent page and then it goes into the photos. Oh my gosh, these photos look so beautiful. You can't beat jumping suits, honestly. They all look so beautiful. Different color suits. Utah's wearing a beautiful turtleneck. Kayla looks amazing. Oh my god. That was so good. Okay, this calendar is going to be amazing. I can really tell it. The pages are quite thin for diary pages. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my god. Models. Oh my god. Okay, well. You know, it's looking very beautiful. They look very, it's very autumn-y, which is really nice because it's going into autumn at the moment for me. Oh my god, they look, they're models. They are models. Oh my god. And at the bottom it says Hazel Jump and it has all their names. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh my, that's such a... I don't know if you know now, but Kato has cutters here. He's got shorter hair now. And I'm not sure how I feel about it. He still looks beautiful, very beautiful, but like, oh my god, these photos. They're so. Oh, so this is a. Was it monthly or weekly? It's a weekly. No, it's not week. It's like a few weeks. It's a fort. Ah, two week calendar, it said. So it's fortnightly. Fortnight calendar. I honestly. Kato's birthday. I honestly probably won't be using this because it is like a collector's item and with all my items I don't really like to use them if they're collector's items like this so I'll probably just have this displayed in my bedroom somewhere or next month next next fortnight Arioka oh my gosh she looks so beautiful this whole like style black and white like very geometric shaped clothing is so beautiful yeah and has his birthday there as well oh yes Yes, boys, get it. Yuya, Yuto, looking very dapper. Oh my god, oh my god. Look. Oh, that's so beautiful. Oh my god. Here's that, um, Yuto has the little, what is it called? The little, like, the, when you kiss somebody, the little, you put, lift your foot up, like in the Princess Diaries. Oh my god. Oh, that's so beautiful. Oh, you know. Oh, he's so beautiful. You know what these pages look like, don't really need to see them. Oh my, oh my, boy, boy, yes. These, oh my god, these photos. Shinen, oh my god, Yabu looks so good here. I love Yabu with dark hair. Don't get me wrong, he looks good with blonde hair, but like, dark haired Yabu is just beautiful. So beautiful. At least it's complexion and makes him look so good. Oh, he can do. Look at him. Very beautiful. Oh my god. I love these photos. I love these outfits as well. The stylist did a real good job. I love how all the hair colors are kind of dark. Except UT's, he's got kind of like a light brown kind of color. Oh my god. So cute! Hikaru and Arioka. Oh my god, Eno. Eno, stop it. Stop it. Oh, I look like some dads. Look at it, such a dad. <laughs> oh my god! Their faces on this one. Jinin and Yamada, of course. Oh, this is so beautiful. Oh my god. Look at Carol's Adam's apple. Honestly. Oh my god. I love these. I love these so much. Mm. Oh my god. I love like men wearing traditional like kimono or yukata like just traditional Japanese clothing. Look how beautiful they are. Oh my god. They look so dapper. My heart, I can't take this. I, t I can't take. Oh, you talk. Oh my god. You look so good. I can't take this. I can't take. I'm being bombarded by beautiful Kato photos. Look how precious he looks. Imagine sitting there and like, just like looking at the beautiful view of Japan with him. I can't. I can't. I physically can't. Oh my god. 
Arsch. Ich glaube, Hika. Hehehe. <lacht> Kurs. Oh mein Gott, das ist so precious. Look at them. Oh mein Gott. Yuya und Ino sehen nichts zu each other. Ja, ihr tut ja auch nicht so Oh my god. What is Keiko doing? Is this at the end? Me. It's so precious. Oh my god. Oh. I don't know if you can tell, but these photos are like so high definition and just so beautiful. Oh, I love them so much. Oh, my precious boys. Look at them. Oh my god, look how cute Yamada is. Stop. <laughs> I'm crying inside. Oh. Boys, boys, boys. Um, can you not? Beauties. Oh my god. Yamada's lost weight. And that makes me feel very sad. He obviously has a very busy schedule, so like, lately he hasn't been probably eating as much as he would, but I want him, sh I want him to like, just make sure he's healthy and eating enough. Oh, he's very cute. Oh my, oh. <laughs> oh, I'm so soft for Hase Jump. Oh my god, they're eating dangle. I got my favorite things in the world. Oh, they look so good. <laughs> Me? Oh my god, Arioka. Oh my god, no, these are so precious. Oh my god. This looks like the type of thing you're seeing like a tourist magazine for like Japan. They could promote Japan, honestly. Look at this. Oh my god, it makes you feel like you're there with them traveling. Oh my god. Wow, I don't know where they shot this, but this is beautiful. Like, honestly. The, just the whole setting is beautiful. Oh, Chiming. Look at him. He's grown up so much lately. He's still short, but like, he's matured a lot. Mm. Look at him. You, yeah, I see you. Oh my god. Beauties. Oh. I think this might be actually my favorite photo so far. Look at them. Oh, they're so beautiful. <laughs> Can't tell. I feel like I've been blessed with so many nice full page photos of Kato and I am not complaining. Give me more. Oh, he's like moist. Look at this boy. He's per- like, pers 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 perspirating. Pers oh fuck. I can't English. He's sweating. Oh my god, I love this. I have seen this photo before actually. I saw some spoilers of this calendar on Twitter, but not too many. But oh my god, boys. Gosh dang, these photos. They are very erotic. Oh my god, Yamada. He he is a model. I mean he does do modeling, but like he is a model. Mm. Utah. Boy. I have to take a break. I need some holy water. I can't survive on this. Oh my god. Look, tell me not. This one could be seen in like all the high end like fashion magazines, you know? Like, honestly. He, he could be in Vogue or something. Oh my god. I love this. Okay, take this back. This is my favorite photo. Great photo so far of this. Oh my god, look at them. They're just beautiful. Oh, Chinen. He still somehow looks cute. Oh my god, look at them. I love the bad boy kind of concept they're going for here. In their hell on a beach and everything. Yabuhika has been put together again. See, even the book, people who have created this book know, know the chips. <laughs> for some reason, this kind of reminds me of like, you know, 2009 MySpace era. The bangs. Yabu. Kind of reminds me of school, like a school um uniform kind of thing. Oh dang boys, hey say seven. I see you. Dang. 
That suit's really nice that Kat is wearing. Oh, hey! Eno and Yuya as well. All the ships. Oh, dang, boys. Oh my god, he looks so cute. He looks like, like a university lecturer or something. Oh my god. Look at them. Eno looks really good. What are you doing with his hands? Is some weird gang sign? It's part of the Illuminati. Illuminati confirmed. Oh, please. Okay, there's so many aspects happening in this photo. We've got the we've got the uncles, the proud uncles. This is like a family get together. We've got the uncles. Then you've got the mothers sitting down drinking tea. <laughs> but of course, Arioka is that one like single mother. Who's judging all of his friends? Oh my god. Dang, boys, dang. Oh my god. <sighs> Thank you, stylists, for putting them in normal, beautiful, like everyday, wintry, soft clothes and make them look so fluffy. Oh my god. What are they? Oh, that's like a okay, I'm Like, where, where are they? Oh, that's like a bamboo forest. Oh my god, these are so pretty. Dang, boys, look at Hikaru. That, that's a model photo right there. Very beautiful though, but like, dang. Like I said dang so much, I'm just so breathless. I'm blown away. Oh, yes. Oh my god, okay. Sorry, I'm gonna go through these one by one because yes. So here one mixture of like aesthetic kind of photos and photos of them. I'm hoping that someone's taken by the members. Because that would be quite pretty. Because that's why I liked in the calendar, not last year's but the years before, they had these little Polaroids and some of them were taken by the members. I thought that was really cute. So I've got them in yukatas. Just really cute. Like, it makes you feel like you're like there with them, you know? And you're like, looking over like past summer photos or whatever. It just makes you feel like you're there with them. Oh my god, is that Kato? It is playing his guitar. Dang boy. Oh, it's so cute. It's kind of reminds me of BTS, not gonna lie. Oh my god. Kato. I see you. Just more photos. <sighs> That'd be so fun to go on like a road trip with them. Just like any trip. Ah, love and thank all oh, my boys. Oh my boys. <laughs> oh my god, they're so cute. Like, Arioka is really stuck in there. And this is past, present, future, 10 years, Heisei Jump. Oh, what is this? So, question one 10 years, before 10 years, member. Oh my god, they're like little profiles! Bless! So, name, birthdays, blood type, birthplace. Look how beautiful he is. To me. So, he's written some things to himself. And then here, all oh, these just little things to like, other members. Oh my god, messages to members. Look at it, oh my god. I wanted to go practice my Japanese and end up reading these later. Oh my god, it's in this Shinan's. His messages to self. And messages to members. Oh my god. Bless, this is such a nice idea. Yuto. <laughs> this outfit kind of makes him look like, I feel like it could be a bit tailored a bit better. That's just me. Boy. I love how I style Kato's clothing. Like, it's really like rock star, you know. Rocker kind of vibes. Love it so much. Really suits his um personality. And Yoka. Looking like a university lecturer again. I think this is his aesthetic. Oh my god, Yuya. Dang, boys. Oh, Eno. He's so, like, just beautiful. 
I can't with milk. I just can't. Pikachu. Oh boy. Damn boys. I need to stop saying it. Yabu. So cute. I love a photo. Oh my god. So it's the signatures. Oh my god. For some reason I just love seeing their handwriting. So I've seen them write their names in their little um in their handwriting. Like Kato's kanji is so pretty. Oh my god. It's just so nice. Yamada's yeah, a bit that's a bit messy, isn't it? Please. Oh, this is so precious. This is so. Look how precious. They look so precious. Oh my god, I'm so soft. Oh, have a good 2018 to 2019 from Hazy Dump. I will, my boys. You'll definitely help it. Oh, look at them. Oh my god, you know. Oh, it's so precious. Nice and small calendar. Okay, the last photo. Oh, this is cute. In the back, you can put your name, your address, telephone, and um, birthday. Just in case you lose it, you lose your precious, priceless Hazy Jab book. So the back looks like this. Believe me, if I end up losing this, like, I'm pretty sure, like, most of my school will be like, yeah, this is Georgina. This is only one trash person who would have one of these. But this is so beautiful. So overall, my review for the Hasty Jump 2018 to 2019 calendar. Um, first of all, I think they're kind of like, I've noticed this for the past, I bought the past two years calendars. So I've, um, I've got three calendars in total. So I haven't got like all of them, but I've, for some reason I've been seeing a steady decline in the quality of them. As for one, this box is quite significantly smaller than the previous years and because you actually have to kind of open, this box just unfolds and becomes basically a piece of cardboard. What I like about the previous year's um, boxes is that the box itself was kind of like a collector's item, you know, and all, you could keep it in pristine condition and um, I've still got all of my boxes and they're sitting under my bed at the moment, but like they're really easy to keep and they're so nice to store your things in still. So that's the first thing I noticed. So the, second, the second thing is that I noticed is that I don't have a wall calendar, which really, <laughs> really annoys me because um, if you can see right here, this is my previous year's wall calendar. Um, this year, from the previous year to this, this wall calendar was way bigger. It covered down here. So I saw last year that the wall calendar did get smaller, which kind of annoying since I put more photos up here, but whatever. At least it was a wall calendar, and this year there was no wall calendar at all. So I'm gonna have to either keep this up or find a new calendar or just fill it up with more pictures, which kind of sucks because I actually did quite like having a calendar there. Oh my god, I did quite enjoy having a calendar on my wall. Um, I could if I wanted to buy a calendar from another group, but that is another quite a big expense especially for international fans seeming that the calendar did cost me like $50 which is ridiculous because with shipping and stuff it just it escalates the price to a much more like out of reach price for a calendar even though I know it's not just a calendar but so I'm a bit disappointed in that but then in saying that I really did appreciate this um planner calendar diary thing I know they've done this in a year prior They've done like something similar to this. I think it was the one before. So it wasn't the 2000 and I think it was 2015, 14 to 15, 15 to 16 that they had um, a similar kind of booklet like this. And the, don't get me wrong, the boxing is beautiful. I really love um, the high quality photos. And I really appreciate because it's kind of like a photo book for me. You know, I haven't got a hasty dump photo book before. Um, but annoying me, it's got to sit in my shelf as a collector's item and I'm not going to use it, which is a bit of a shame. But what I am happy about is that they have this little um, 
desktop calendar because I actually am currently using the other desktop calendar that sits in my corner. It's very nice and I like how this is a monthly calendar instead of a weekly calendar because as I mentioned before, having a weekly calendar is kind of annoying to keep keep up with and having to keep changing it because I actually did end up missing up on a few weeks and missing out on a few photos which sucks but I really do actually like this idea because it's just a cute little um, item to have on your desk. Um, so as for uh, comparing to other years I feel like this year it wasn't as worth the price as the previous years. The previous years last year you got um, a calendar and a little um, weekly cards to put in a little side like this one and the year previous to that you got polaroids all the members in like a monthly calendar and also a wall calendar so this year i feel like it's a bit lacking which is a bit sad but i will still definitely buy it next year and i'm not complaining because i know there's a little bit of speculation around if they're actually having a calendar this year because normally when johnny's group hit their 10 year anniversary and no longer make the calendars so I'm very happy that Joyce are still deciding to make Hey Say Jump calendars because it was quite a big market for them, especially from the fans. But anyway, I've been talking for ages. Um, overall, I thought, yes, it was a cute calendar, could have been better. I'm a bit disappointed with not having a wall calendar. But overall, I thought it was really good and I um, thought the pictures were really cute and the stylist did a good job and the backdrops looked amazing. Anyway, thanks for watching my unboxing. I'll see you next time. Bye.